In this episode of 10 Best Ones, we are going to check out the top 5 best laptops for college in 2018. I made this list based on my personal opinion, and I tried to list them based on their price, quality, durability and more. If you want to see the price and find out more information about these laptops, you can check out the links down in the description and the comment section below. Ok, so, let's get started with the video. At number 5, we have the Lenovo Flex 11. Since we will be talking about laptops that would enhance your productivity as a student, then, as usual, we will start with a laptop that is extremely affordable, yet quality at the same time, such as the Lenovo Flex 11. From a design perspective, the Flex 11 features a convertible, 2-in-1 design that is composed of a grey plastic lid which is clothed with a grey rubber bumper with the intention to add some sturdiness. In addition, there are two flexible, rounded hinges that support the screen, and they will let you use this unit in a laptop mode, tent mode, tablet mode, and in a stand mode, which basically means that you can use it however you want. When you open the lid, at the very bottom, you will see a buttonless touchpad that has a really smooth surface, so you won't have any trouble while swiping on it, such as working with PowerPoint, switching between tabs and more. Above the touchpad, there is the keyboard, which looks really good with its grey buttons that have white labelings, so, I have to admit that the keyboard matches with the overall laptop's aesthetics. Unfortunately, the keyboard isn't backlit, which is normal in this price range, so you shouldn't stress much. The connectivities include an HDMI 3.0 port, an SD card slot and a USB Type-C port that's used for charging, and all of them are placed on the left. On the right, there is a volume rocker, a headphone jack, and a lock slot, which is great for the price. Now, let's talk about the features. The Flex 11 has an 11.6-inch 11 HD IPS anti-glare multi-touch display, with 250 nits of brightness, which is more than good for your casual student work. Aside from it, the movies look great and since it is IPS, you know that the color consistency is at its highest. Moreover, this unit has a great hardware as well, or to be more precise, the 4GB of RAM, 32GB of flash storage, and the 2.1GHz ARM quad-core processor will surely increase your productivity. Overall, if you're looking for an affordable laptop with 10 hours of battery life, then the Flex 11 would be a top option. Moving on, at number 4 we have the Asus Vivobook F510UA. The Asus Vivobook is a real example of a modern laptop that integrates a powerful hardware, excellent build quality, and a reasonable price that will maximize your productivity like you've never tasted before. From a design perspective, the Vivobook features an impressively thin 0.8-inch profile that is entirely made of plastic which mimics an aluminum and makes it comparable with laptops that cost more than $1,000. When you open the lid, you will instantly see the touchpad that is positioned at the bottom center, while at the top right corner of the touchpad, there is a fingerprint reader that will exclude you from the need to type passwords every time you want to log in. The touchpad itself has a great build quality, and so far, users haven't shown any remarks in terms of functionality. Above the touchpad, there is a chiclet-style keyboard that has a decent key travel so you can type quickly, and accurately, without any problem. The connectivities are minimalistic as the laptop's construction, but you will be well equipped though. So, there is a USB 2.0 port, one USB 3.0 port, single USB 3.1 Type-C port, a full-sized HDMI port, 3.5mm headset and an SD card reader which is great. But now, let's talk about the performance. The Vivobook uses an IPS Full HD Nanoge display with an ultra-narrow 0.3-inch bezel which is great in my opinion, due to the fact that the 15.6-inch screen is ideal for content sharing with your colleagues and friends. The laptop's hardware is truly magnificent, because it is equipped with the 8th gen of Intel i5 processor, an Intel UHD 620 graphics, 8GB of RAM, 1TB HDD, and 128GB SSD, which will ensure quick loading times, plenty of tabs and apps running at the same time, so you can do plenty of stuff at once. Moreover, the battery life can last between 4 to 6 hours depending on your usage which is still good, since you can always plug it to your charger and keep working. To conclude, I'd recommend you consider the Vivobook, if you're looking for a laptop that justifies its price tag with its blazing fast performance. Moving on, at number 3 we have the HPX 362-in-1. 
The Spectre X360 is a 2018 model that surprised the market positively due to its powerful hardware and sleek design that people find it similar to the Apple MacBook Air. From a design perspective, the X360 has a 2-in-1, foldable design which is covered with a dark ash silver color that looks wonderful for both scenarios, when you will be holding it to your hand or having it placed to your desktop. The hinges that support the screen are incredibly flexible yet sturdy at the same time, so they will let you use this laptop in four modes such as a tent, tablet, stand and as a laptop depending on what you want to achieve in that particular moment. When the lid is opened, then you can simply admire its touchpad and the full-sized, island-style keyboard. To be more specific, the touchpad has a really smooth surface that will register every single glide you make with your fingers, while the keyboard itself has an excellent build quality so you can type precisely, and comfortably, for a prolonged period of time. However, the keyboard isn't backlit, which I think that HP could have done a better job. The connectivities consist of two USB 3.1 ports, a single HDMI port, one LAN port, headphone and mic combo jack, a multi-format SD card reader, and a USB 3.1 Type-C port that allows a data transfer of up to 5GB per second, so I can forgive to HP for the non-backlit keyboard. Now, let's talk about the features. The X360 is packed with a 15.6-inch Full HD, IPS, multi-touch edge-to-edge screen that is maybe one of the best in the market when it comes to the performance and the price you pay. According to the users, the visuals and the color accuracy are fantastic so HP deserves some applaud. In terms of the hardware, this unit is powered by the 7th gen of Intel i5 processor, a dedicated AMD Radeon 530 graphics, 8GB of RAM, and a 128GB SSD which are more than adequate for doing tasks really quick. The battery life can last up to 8 hours of usage, but take in mind that this may vary. Overall, the HP is a must-have for everyone who is looking for a laptop for college-related purposes. Moving on, at number 2 we have the Microsoft Surface Pro. The Microsoft Surface Pro is a real all-rounder, so both the students and professionals may use it for their purposes, but in this video, we will be oriented towards the students. From a design perspective, the Surface Pro shines with elegance, due to the fact that the body was crafted with a magnesium alloy frame with rounded edges that make it incredibly portable and lightweight at the same time. That's why, you can use it in three modes, starting from the laptop mode, studio mode, and in a tablet mode if you remove or fold the Pro Signature type cover, so it will function as a standalone Intel tablet. When it comes to the keyboard, this link contains only the device itself, so you have an opportunity to grab a black, burgundy, cobalt blue and platinum colored depending on what you want to achieve. However, all four of them are unique and are performing incredibly good. Regardless if you're typing on the keyboard, on swiping on the touchpad, all of your clicks and swipes will be effectively registered so I think that you will love them. Moreover, the 12.3-inch PixelSense touchscreen looks beautiful with a maximum resolution of 2736 by 1824 in terms of pixels, so regardless of the mode in which you use this unit, you will never be disappointed. There is a decent load of connectivity ports as well, so you can find a single USB 3.0 port, a mini DisplayPort, one micro SDXC card reader and a headphone and mic combo jack. But now, let's talk about the performance. The Surface Pro comes in different hardware specs, but I've chosen the one that integrates 4GB of RAM, 128GB SSD, and an Intel Core i5 processor, which is great for students who are unlikely to spend much money for a laptop. Therefore, these specs are more than good to equip you with quick loading times, and increase your productivity as well, especially when the finals are coming. Finally, the battery life is rated to up to 13.5 hours of usage according to the manufacturer, but this may vary. Either way, even 10 hours of usage in practice would be great. To conclude, the Surface Pro is a great option for every student who is looking for a portable and fast 2-in-1 laptop. At number 1, we have the Dell XPS 13. The Dell XPS 13 would be a perfect option for every student who is looking for a laptop that combines a long battery life, great hardware, and a rock-solid design that will leave you speechless from the moment you take it out of the box. 
From a design perspective, the 9360 features an all-aluminum unibody design that integrates a carbon fiber base, and a 13.3-inch Infinity touchscreen that is protected by a Corning Gorilla Glass 4, for your ultimate protection and experience. What makes this laptop different from the others that we've mentioned earlier, is its full-size, backlit keyboard that will increase your visibility during the nights. The keys themselves, are smooth and feel comfortable at your fingertips, so you wouldn't have to push hard in order to get your types registered properly. In addition, its large, buttonless touchpad is extremely responsive, so you won't have to swipe twice in order to move around. The connectivities are robust, so you can find two USB 3.0 ports, a single multi-format SD card reader, a headset jack, one noble lock slot, a display port, and a Thunderbolt 3 port, which I especially like. Now, let's talk about the features. The XPS 9360, has an exclusive 13.3-inch Infinity Edge Full HD touchscreen that produces an accurate color representation and maintains their consistency regardless of the adjustments you make. Moreover, the 8th gen of an Intel quad-core i5 processor, the 8GB of RAM, the 128GB SSD, and the integrated Intel HD Graphics 620 card, are sufficient for everything you would search, for your college-related purposes. Or even better said, you can have plenty of apps installed, and have many tabs and tasks running at the same time, which means that you can do plenty of work for a short period of time. According to those who have previously purchased this product, the battery life varies upon usage, so there are people that had like 12 hours of battery, some of them had 16, when the laptop wasn't under a heavy workload, but either way, it is pretty long. Overall, the XPS 13, would be a great addition to every user who wants to do all of the college work effectively and quickly. Thanks for watching, I hope you liked this video. If this video was helpful to you, please remember to leave a like and subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this in the future, and if you have any questions related to them, please leave a comment down below and I will get back to you as soon as I can.